to the city the other day. We only ended up vlogging maybe five minutes because we received a phone call during the drive. Not a phone call, sorry. We received some information during the drive. We were expecting said information, but we weren't expecting the outcome of that information, to say the least. Um, it was, I don't want to get into too much detail right now. We will find out more on March 20th and then I will fill you guys in on exactly what I'm talking about. So for now I have to talk a little cryptic. Anyway, so the information we receive is going to change the next three years of our lives. And it's not bad news by any means. Come on people, some people don't know how to drive. Um, so yeah, it's not bad news. It's just we weren't expecting it. We were expecting something entirely different. It's not baby related. It's not related to the brand I've been working on. It's something completely different. And we look forward to filling you guys in when the time is right. But like I said, we have to wait until the 20th when we find out more information. So we ended up being, you know, kind of shocked and emotional for the rest of the drive and the rest of the trip. And, you know, we're not really used to picking up the camera yet film all of our emotions. Yeah, that's gonna take some getting used to. Come on, man, drive. Like, I swear to God, when people come to a four-way stop, they have no idea when they have the right away. <laughs> when they don't. Anyway, I'm getting totally off track. I don't even know where I left off. So let's just sum it up by saying we got some life-changing information. We only end up vlogging for five minutes. So that's that. So I will fill you in a little bit on how my appointment went to check my uterine lining. That is some bad news. <laughs> I'm telling you, it never ends. Um, last time we went through this with the fresh IVF cycle, the entire time my uterine lining and my uterus was gold star. Like, bam, there it is. As soon as you've seen it on the ultrasound, you can measure it, you can see it. Everything was absolutely perfect. It measured perfectly. There was not a glitch whatsoever. This time, it took two nurses to even find my uterine lining to measure it. They were getting all types of sizes, ranging from 6.3, 6.8, 7.3, 7.9, 8. And ideally, they want it to be at least 8 millimeters before they will do the frozen embryo transfer. So that was kind of a blow. We were expecting the transfer to be next week, but now I have to not only increase the dose of my medicine, the estrace, the estrogen, but I also am not taking it orally anymore, I'm taking it. So that is really unpleasant. And I have to go back on the 11th to get another ultrasound to remeasure. And that is causing quite stress, quite amount of stress, I can't even speak. Um, because if I go back and it's still not measuring, <clears throat> excuse me, frog in the throat, if it's still not measuring at least eight millimeters, I think this cycle will be canceled and there will be no baby making right now. Which sucks because, you know, obviously we really want to get moving forward with this and not only that, we will be out another $2,000 for a failed cycle yet again. So there's that. <laughs> So, yeah, that's why I just, I didn't feel like picking up the camera. The two of us were in shock, the two of us were stressed, we were emotionally exhausted, physically exhausted, and yeah. So right now I will insert the footage that we did get, now. Okay, so there's a mountain in front of us. Oh my god, like, where? This past the bridge, the Seal Island Bridge. Oh, Most people well known. Most people call it the Sea Lion Bridge. Sea Lion. It's on the cliff. Sea Lion. Anyway, yeah. So we're just looking for the mountain that's supposed to be directly in front of us. Lovely. Oh, oh wait, it's coming a little bit. Okay. <laughs> the top of the mountain should be like right where my finger is. That's not. Like, is that like ice pellets here? I think it's changing over to ice rain. It's not rain before. You're like, aggravated or are you about to strive already, Tuts? Not very much. You're not aggravated at all? No. Yeah, their hair's not getting wet. No, it's already wet, bro. 
No, it's not even. It's not even frizzy. It's maggoty. It's not even. You're such a maggot. Oi. If Tootsie was a coffee drinker, I would have said she needed noise, a coffee. Toots. What? What's that? Ice pellets. I don't see them, do they? Oh, well, because you're so hypnotized. If you look at the car in front of us, the black car, you can see. You can see them coming down. I just don't physically. Shouldn't they be popping up the wind chair? They're probably popping and bouncing. Lock and pop, pop like and lock. It's, pop it like it's hot. This video is going to be shown to our kid in 20 years. Let's see. We're going to say, see how much you aggravated us right from the get-go before you were even implanted. Nuisance. Ground it already. Ground it. Yeah, because I didn't sleep. There it is. Look how pretty it is, though. We should come up here for our pictures. Pictures? Pictures. Yeah, I know. on the Sea Island Bridge. Yeah, but you would get hit. The traffic is way too much. We just want to block it, you know. A block a. You're talking like so choppy today. <laughs> pictures. Block a. I can't knock up no. Jesus. Hey, Zeus. <laughs> What are you saying? Hey, Zeus. Because you're like crossing the median. Where That's is called? the median at? There's not when you hear that call. noise, get the frig to the right. <laughs> okay, well, see you on the other side of the mountain. If <laughs> Tootsie doesn't fall asleep at the wheel first. Okay, buddy. He's like trying to tell us to hurry up. Well, we want us to end up in the ditch there, Ossifer? Because it ain't happening. We'll go at a speed that's safe for us, right, Tuts? That's right. Did you see that? What yeah. happened anyway? Just kind of went off. Well, it looked like that he kind of went off in the ditch because he probably was going at a speed that was like a sunny summer's day. No. So we're at the top of the mountain and it's still looking crapola. That was slick over there to try to get past that. Well, yeah, because the cop was like, come on, hurry up. Well, yeah, you hurry up on this slick road there. Then you'll be pulling us out of the ditch. He's like, frig, man. Yeah, What's he doing to the rotator cuff injury? <laughs> <laughs> I love how no matter what, you always have a medical reference for everything. Uh, uh, My girl. This car is driving on the wrong side of the road, so let's see what his fate decides. There you go. Driving, you know, like, I know, eh? I'm trying to find a nice simmering spot. So you see, short and sweet is all you get. But we'll get better. Will get better at this vlogging thing, I am determined. Right now, Amy has gone away to the country for a friend's birthday for the night. I couldn't go because I have work at 7.30 in the morning, which is actually gonna feel like 6.30 in the morning because the clocks go ahead tonight. So that is not looking forward to that. So while she's away, I'm heading to the grocery store to get some snacks for tonight because when it's just me, I don't feel like cooking big meals. I just feel like picking all day, and I know it's not the healthiest, but so be it. And after the grocery store, I am heading in to check out some new makeup brushes because I've been cheap all my life using those stupid little sponges that come with eyeshadows and such, and I just want to upgrade to some brushes. So that's that. And I'll probably take the kids out. By the kids, I mean the dogs. Probably take the kids out into the snow and play for a little while because the temperature is actually only minus three degrees Celsius today, which feels super warm when you're used to like minus 25, 30, 40. Yeah. Hence why I took advantage of not wearing a winter jacket. And I know most Americans, especially people in California and Florida and such, will probably be like minus three, girl, you were cray cray for not wearing a jacket, but I'm tough. And what else? Not too much exciting today. It's Saturday, and I plan on uploading the vlog tonight. This vlog. Back to the life-changing event, leaving you guys with more suspense with cryptic talk. But our wedding is October 10th. You have to stay put. You don't dare blow in front of me. Thank you very much. Our wedding is October 10th, and this is going to make the wedding very <laughs> difficult, to say the least. I say to say the least a lot. I gotta stop that. You know when you vlog, you pick up on annoying little habits and stuff that you do. It's actually kind of good because then you can look back and focus on changing the shit that you don't like about yourself. 
the next year of our life is going to be very, 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 very busy, but exciting. And I'm really excited to, about my brand. I am jumping from topic to topic, but you know, <laughs> just deal with it, okay? I am very excited about the logo and the brand that I've come up with. I've been talking to a friend of mine who's into marketing and branding, and she absolutely loved it. And I've been showing another good friend who's um, into business. She has an MBA in business, and she loved it. And then I showed just a couple of other friends. I don't want to show too many people until it's registered, because obviously, if the idea goes somewhere, someone can steal it, and I can do nothing about it because I didn't register it, so that would be stupid. But um, the few friends that I did show for personal opinion, they loved it, and they want me to make clothing like yesterday so they can have some. And I'll fill you in more on that later. Right now I'm going to go into the store. And the errands are done and didn't go quite like I had hoped. I get in there to buy makeup brushes and call me cheap, call me a tomboy, call me what you will, but I just can't imagine spending $15 on one makeup brush when I know I can get a whole set, a good set online for like $15 because I know where. And in the grocery store, I was craving jalapeno cheddar chips and they only sell them in this one grocery store and there was none. So there's that. So getting back into this vlogging thing, I'm finding it a struggle when I'm alone because I don't really know what to talk about because when I don't have somebody talking back to me, I don't really have a lot to say. So if you guys could talk back to me through the camera, that'd be great. Maybe you guys could talk to me in the comments, ask me questions. I'll answer them. I'm not one to hide who I am, and that guy's going on the wrong side there. I swear to God, every crazy driver is out today. I should have my camera pointed this way, because I'll probably capture some kind of shenanigans. But yeah. I'll eventually get better. I know like when I watch every vlogger on YouTube, when I go back to their beginning videos, they're just as awkward as I am. And it's like, okay, so I'm not alone. And I'm about to take my Superfact. Superfact is one of the drugs I have to take for IVF. It has to be snort it in each nostril, one snort in each nostril five times a day. That's how annoying that is. So, do you guys want to watch me take it? How exciting! Ooh, I got this tripod in between my knees. Hold on so that I can master this. Okay, ready? And that's what you do for that. And then sometimes my left nostril is a little bit stubborn, so I have to tilt my head back because I don't know why it won't go in as clearly as the right, but yeah. So that's the super fact. I take that five times a day at 7, 11, 3, 7, and 11. And I take the S trace twice a day, five tablets twice a day. And we just won't mention where. So. Yeah, just hanging out, watching some Casey Lavier. I have a lot of vlogs to catch up on, like so many. I am literally months behind on so many vlogs, but there's no way I'm gonna catch up. So I'm just gonna have to flick through everybody's vlogs and just <laughs> pick which ones I want based on how interesting their title sounds, I guess. Sorry guys, but uh, there's no way, there's no way I have the time to catch up on all of them, so.